Australopithecus afarensis is the most famous species of Australopithecine, which is known from 3.9 to 3 million years ago. Australopithecus afarensis has been found in several sites in Ethiopia, in several sites in Kenya, in Tanzania, and also in Chad. The Chad discovery is exciting because it is far to the west of the original discovery sites, indicating that this species and perhaps hominids in general were more widespread than previously thought. Uh, many of these uh, finds have been influential because they include the famous Lucy and first family fossils discovered. The skull of Australopithecus afarensis certainly appears more like that of chimps and other apes and less like those of humans. The cranial capacity of 375 to 500 cc's is within chimp range, although it is slightly larger than the chimp average. The face protrudes farther than in the flat-faced humans, although the protrusion of the face is a little bit less than that seen in chimps. The teeth are intermediate between those of chimps and hominids, especially the canines and premolars. Perhaps the most significant change in the skull is the position of the foramen magnum, which allowed for bipedal posture since it allowed the skull to sit directly over the vertebral column rather than resting at an angle as in chimps and gorillas. And so while the skull uh, certainly seems more ape-like than human-like, there are some modifications so that it is a transitional skull with features intermediate between uh, those of other apes and those of humans.